<sighs> Cycles are amazing, no? They've taken humans everywhere in the world they've wanted to be without relying on animals or fuel. But that's where things get interesting. Because humans have relied so heavily upon investing the least amount of energy to get to a place. And that's why we don't see them anymore. But that wasn't the case when you were in your childhood. You weren't that old when you laid hands on your first cycle and it became your source of freedom and nothing beat the feeling of riding it. And then you grew older and your cycle got bigger. But the cycle and your perception about it remained the same. Until one day, this happened. But they've more or less remained the same in the modern world. The thing is, cycles haven't really changed for the last 200 years. And that's a point of concern, right? Because nobody's actually using them. But things are changing now. They're going electric. The joys of riding. Okay, so I've been riding this bike for about 25 to 30 kilometers today and I must say, adding something electric to a bicycle is made something so robust a revolutionary item. And hats off to the folks at Copernicus who've made something so special. Well, this thing feels so similar to a bicycle but way far apart. Especially in an urban environment like this where you would like to attack the roads. Okay, so I've ridden for about 35 kilometers today and the T3 has gotten me through all of this effortlessly without breaking a sweat. I am a little tired right now but that's mostly because it's sunny outside and nothing to do with the cycle as much. 
Well, hats off to the folks at Copernicus for making something so practical but usable on the daily basis. And that's what they originally set out to do. So I think they've achieved 100% of their goal. We're talking about premium preload adjustable suspension, a really sturdy chassis, a really high density battery and motor, and a 10 speed Shimano gearbox. And all of this come together to give you a premium but effortless ride experience. The cycle with the pedal assist gets you through different situations really easily and you don't really use the gearbox that often. So why don't we see bicycles anymore? Well, it's probably because of motorcycles like these. Well, the Copernicus T3 isn't trying to replace a motorcycle in your life. Hell, I'm gonna say it. It's not for everyone. But the ones, the very few of us who want to integrate cycling into our lives or want to commute with them and have been struggling with the concept of putting a ton of effort when compared to other means of transport, well, here's a product that's gonna do exactly what we couldn't until now.